Welcome down to Chesham to World of Adventures and a World of Jumanji update. I've been asked quite a lot over the last couple of weeks when I'm coming back to update. Well, it's now. It's right now. And yes, the spike is done, so technically the whole track is done. It's not testing yet, we know that for a fact, but it can't be far away as we know the train is there. We know the track is done and they are even putting up sort of a ride fence in now. So the area is actually coming together really really quick so enough of me let's see if we can get some close-ups for you and show you what's going on at the world of jumanji here it is here is the shot that i think everyone's been looking forward to here as you can see the ride travels around here does a loop of the jaguar stops at the top and of course at the other end we've got the spike which is beyond vertical in fairness and it's looking spectacular. It really is looking spectacular. As you can see, they are putting up perimeter fencing. So let's get you a few close-ups now. There is the spike. Of course, with the rest of the layout. So we can see here that they're currently installing the ride fencing, which looks very similar to the usual green fencing they've been using everywhere. And of course you can see Mamba Strike there, that's had the back plate put on since we were last here as well. And then sort of where the vehicles are moving, how clear and open the area now is. Lots and lots of space. Coast needs to do a bit of a clean down still, and obviously this area needs to be needs to be done. We would expect some vegetation to be coming around here. Now here we go, the back area of the ride, and you can see the drop, and this is quite, this is quite a dip, this. Before you shoot up into the spike, which as we said is beyond vertical. It'll be interesting to see how far up the spike it goes. But how good does this look? So there's a new theme and element. Could well be the board actually to go on to Ostrich Strike. Possibly though more by the entrance, but these little details are going up. And you can just see Ostrich Strike through there, but we are slightly secluded. The internal theme in which has been put up here. Assuming the top half of the station will probably be filled in, but it might not be. So of course we did reveal before the press images come out that these seats at the back are indeed backwards. The train still hasn't been unwrapped, another reason you know that it isn't, uh, isn't being tested quite yet. But a lot of work's gone on in the station area. A lot of work. And we can see some internal bits here being added as well. On the roof now, we have theming on the roof. Looks like they've made it so like pipe works coming out as well as the vines. Now they are working in the station, but as you can see, there is scenery in the station. Very similar to what we can see this side. A lot of wooden planks, what's gonna be signage there. However, these guys are working on the train. They're on and off the train. Now from this angle, you can see the control cabin is also in over the track. So it'll be very much like Swarm at Fort Park. The lights are on and they are testing it all. That drop is insane. So as we can see again, there's another shot of the control booth, double windowed over the station. Ready for when this thing whizzes through. And here is the drop coming out, as we said. There is a digger in the way, there's nothing that we can do about that digger. 
And of course here again is the drop out of the station, the backwards drop, or forwards I guess if you're at the back, before going into the spike and completing the course. So we believe the structure is something to do with the entrance portal which is yet to go up and as we said the test seat we showed you a good few videos ago now but raw materials here yeah time to wrap it up and here we end lots of lots of work here as we said there are building materials now uh, covered in there what we believe is going to be the entrance the test seat we showed you a, a while ago now a good few videos ago that's been here quite a long time i wouldn't mind betting this is going to be some kind of water feature as you come in uh, by the angles and uh, what they've put in there hmm. make a nice entrance to the park bear in mind this is now the main entrance to the park it will be great to see but you will be greeted with mandrill mayhem right there Ah, oh, it does look good. It does look good. There we go. February update, Chesington World of Adventures, World of Jumanji. Have you enjoyed it? Are you looking forward to it now? They're still not 100% sure where it's opening. It is opening in spring. However, I will just say that Saw the Ride didn't start testing until uh, early February in terms of full testing programs with eight cars. And that opened on the 13th of March. So yeah, don't, don't lose hope. I have a feeling this will be open by Easter. I don't know. I don't know. But believe it or not, with internal things being done and everything else as well, I don't think it's as far away as what you think it is. But from UK Theme Parks, my name's Adam. Thank you for joining us here at Chesington World of Adventures. We will see you next time.